A Capitol Hill showdown and then some. On Tuesday, the House passed a $106 billion emergency war spending bill. The bill helps finance the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. But in a bit of a twist, only five Republicans came out in support of it. According to top House Republicans, it's not about not supporting the troops. It's actually about a provision that gives $5 billion to the International Monetary Fund. This is not uh, about uh, whether uh, we're going to uh, support our troops. This is about asking our troops uh, to put on their backs a $110 billion global bailout. The House originally passed the measure overwhelmingly last month, but the IMF provisions were then added by the Senate. Republicans are calling the provisions a global bailout. Democrats are calling that excuse a cop-out. Well, they're voting against funding the troops, uh, and I, I'm not persuaded by their explanation. President Obama wants the IMF funding and says that the money is needed to cope with the global economic slowdown. That wasn't the only battle on Tuesday. Maybe Major fireworks erupted on the House floor last night after Democrats moved to block Republicans from offering amendments to an annual spending bill. Two of those amendments would cut off federal funding for ACORN. Another would give the Justice Department $2 million to investigate House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's claims that the CIA lied about the interrogations of detainees. Ainsley Earhart, Fox News.